For the love of Pete, Nigel, this office is an absolute pigsty. There's music equipment all over the place. I haven't even made a song in over a decade, it feels like. Got shorts on the ground. I don't even know what that is. Jackson's seat is all up in my business. There's Oh, look. Oh, look, Nigel. Chapstick. There's chapstick on the ground, you stupid... Listen, ugh, I can't live in these conditions. This is bullshit. I just, I would clean the office, I just don't have time. I have a kid now, I'm trying to keep up with making YouTube videos. How am I gonna find the time to clean up my office in between doing all that? You know, you know what? Maybe I can find some tips online for how to clean a little bit more efficiently. Maybe clean a little faster. Maybe speed clean. If I could speed clean this office, I might be able to get it done. Speed cleaning. Perfect, right at the top. Speed cleaning the house for mommies. 1.2 million views, so clearly it's gonna have some fuego tips on how I can get this office clean quick. Let's take a peek. Oh, and it's monetized too, that's good. So, I mean, it's just, it's a cleaning video, of course it's monetized. Hey all, welcome back to cleaning time. I got asked by somebody why I shoot cleaning videos, and it is, I thought about it, you know, to get me to inspire to be cleaning and to inspire other people. It's a simple concept, really. She wants to be inspired to clean, and she wants to help inspire others like me to clean as well. And if I'm being candid, it's 14 seconds in, and I'm already getting that itch to go grab the vacuum. I think to myself, oh, you know what, I should get up and tidy. I should tidy while this video is on, or I learn a new technique to clean, or it just just inspires me. It's easy. Sorry. Oh, my God. Sorry, guys. I know I'm supposed to be making this video, but... Uh, I just got so inspired to clean. I can't follow along. I'm doing do a quick power sweep and tidy through um, of most of the house. Just get everything a little, a little bit picked up and tidy. Okay, guys, I got my notepad and I am ready for some cleaning tips. Let's do this. Put some toys away. Um, the life of cleaning with a family. Oof. Makes such a mess. All right, follow along. Let's get clean. Jesus! What the heck? Don't you close your eyes. Close, do not, do not look at the screen, Nigel. What the f Divine Father, please forgive us for we know not what we do. Hail Mary, full of grace. <laughs> Hello everyone, and welcome back to a brand new Wiz Khalifa EP on vinyl. My name is Leon Lush, and I am so overjoyed to have you joining me here for just a few minutes today. Now before we move on, I want to formally apologize to you guys uh, for the introduction here. I, you know, I'm, I'm over here trying to better my life, learn how to clean this office better so I can feel tidy and be more efficient and be a better worker so I can provide more content for you guys, and all of a sudden we're thrown into this extremely sexually suggestive content. I just did not see, I did not see it coming. <sighs> Anyways, let's persevere and see if we can find some cleaning tips that don't make me feel like I need to talk to a priest afterwards. Tips and tricks for super speed clean. This sounds right up my alley. My children have just went to bed and I'm going you know what to be that's doing like. God a bless. speed cleaning Thank you. of my media room. That's pretty much what this is. This is like a I'm media room is that clean up all the small toys okay. first before you try to vacuum up any crumbs or food because if you leave the toys on the floor then you don't know what's under them and you can't quite vacuum up any mess if there's something on top of them. Hold up a second. You're telling me you're supposed to move things off of the floor before you vacuum? <laughs> I mean. So I'm going to head and get right into All it. Alright, let's do it. Oh, God damn it! I mean, what is going on here? Can a good, wholesome, family-friendly, PG Clean Leon Lush YouTube channel get a couple of cleaning tips without having a half-exposed rear end shoved into my eyeballs? Goodness gracious! Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try this one more time. <laughs> if this ha if that happens again, I'm going I'm deleting YouTube and I'm going I'm going straight to church. Can somebody please just give me some cleaning tips? Straightforward. Not just can I I just want to clean this office. I just I just want to I want to I want to clean the office. I don't want to 
This is a Christian channel. Hello, sparkling rubies. I am armed and I am dangerous. <laughs> Me? A ruby? <laughs> Stop it. Take your uh, okay. vacuum. All right, here's some. You've got your hose. Add on this some legit. These are some brush. legit tips. I hate that it comes with a lot of the I hate cleaning those those kind of closet off. doors. Are the worst. See, now this is what I'm talking about. And sweep away. Okay. Finally, something I can use. Okay, guys, I gotta turn it down a notch because I got sarcasm seeping out of my pores right now. But I want to welcome you to this side of YouTube you may not have known existed until now. I didn't either until just a few hours ago. But this is a side of YouTube where pseudo adult stars, I guess you could call them, they basically make these videos where they're recreating the first five minutes of any Brazzers video you've ever seen, and they're dressing it up and disguising it like a cleaning video in order to stay monetized, of course, and also to help drive, a, you know, a slew of 14-year-olds over to their adults only 18 plus patreon <laughs> and listen no shade from over here man you know leon respects the hustle rise and grind baby right i just i just it's this is like a new level this is like an upgraded like a version 2.2 ios 12.7 <laughs> version of like online female performers it's just <laughs> and i find it hilarious that it like tips and tricks for super speed clean i, I don't know <laughs> <laughs> because if you leave the toys on the floor, then you don't know what's under them. And you can't quite vacuum up any mess if there's something on top of them. Of course! <laughs> of course! Of course! It's genius! Why didn't I think of that? Before you vacuum the floor, pick up the stuff off the floor! It makes sense now! So she breaks us off with this... Cleaning tip right off the bat, and then it's like eight minutes and 30 seconds of just cantaloupes and peach being shoved down our throat. And listen, don't sleep on these videos either. Just the three that we've previewed so far. We're looking at half a million views. We got 1.1 million views, 1.3 million views. Are you kidding? I mean, if Patreon is your product and YouTube is your marketing tool, these are shrewd ass business women. You throw on some booty shorts, you plop a camera down on the coffee table, and then make a time lapse of yourself sweeping the living room for like 15 minutes. 1.3 million views, that's 1.3 million opportunities for people to become your patron. Now the irony of me taking the piss out of these girls is that I basically do the same exact thing. I mean, I provide content for the internet and I'm compensated in various ways through AdSense and merchandise and whatever else. And basically, you know, I, half of the content I make is me making love or making out with a primate doll. I just don't have a Patreon. And I keep my balls inside of my pants. Just That's just a personal choice of mine. And maybe, hell, maybe I missed the boat on that and I, I should have I reconsidered. Let's actually take a look at her Patreon just to see what we're doing here. $14,000 a month! Holy f 251 patrons doesn't seem like that many for the amount she's making. What are her tears looking like here? That's... Oh, that... Oh! Oh, that's because she has 12 $1,000 a month patrons. Whew! Wait, hold on. You get clothing haul try-ons and monthly feel-good advice included in that tier? Okay, I take that back. This $1,000 a month is starting to feel like an early Black Friday special. And speaking of Black Friday... <laughs> speaking of Black Friday, I just dropped a piece of hot new merch. It's, uh, it's my, it's my Christmas, my ugly Christmas sweater design just went live. And you can get it now all the way through the weekend at 25% off if you use code UGLYTOMATO. Check it out. Really cool. I'm whoring myself out just like these girls are, but you know this is this is the inter this is the internet. So buy my ugly Christmas sweater design. <laughs> Great. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, I make jokes obviously, but clearly these ladies are purebred entrepreneurs. I mean, these are some impressive numbers, and I, I you gotta you have to imagine that these speed cleaning videos that are driving all this traffic are probably playing a hand in those numbers. Oh look, this other girl has a $1,000 a month tier as well that is sold out. <laughs> that is, this is impressive stuff right now, I gotta tell you. I just, curiosity gets the best of me sometimes though. I would love to meet the dudes paying $1,000 a month to like, 
get bubble bath videos sent to them by some of these. I'm just, you know, everyone's into their own thing. I get it, but like that's like you could mortgage a house for a thousand dollars a month. I have, I imagine it's like really, like really rich IT nerds or something. You know, they're making two hundred and fifty k a year working coding in some little back hole, and they never dream of going out and meeting someone in real life. So what's twelve thousand dollars a year when you're making two hundred and fifty k? To get personal Snapchats and bubble bath and like used clothes sent to you in the mail. I that's a bargain as far as I'm concerned. I'm sorry, was that too far? I just I can never tell anymore. It's like every time I do something, every video I make, it's like there's more people getting triggered in the comments. You know, that as you grow on YouTube, it's like you gotta be more and more careful about what you say. You can't talk about e-girls that way. That's terrible, Leon. I just I understand they're family women, right? They got kids, but they're making those ends. They're making that bread, baby. I got nothing but respect for the grind, you know what I'm saying? But I mean, if you can't take the piss out of a couple of e-girls on YouTube, not not only that, like they're in my backyard. You're on YouTube trying to pretend like you're making cleaning videos, but you're shuttling millions of dollars, excuse me, millions of impressions to your Patreon. I see you. I I see you. I see what you're doing, keeping it family friendly, bringing them in the back door to the 18 plus Patreon. These are some these are some sneaky ass tactics, man. I see it smells I smell sneaky. There's a this is some whew. anyways, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I'm not always right. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. I am. But it's possible. It's possible that, you know, these millions of views they're getting on these you know, speed cleaning videos aren't from you know, the largest demographic on YouTube, which is 13 to 8 year olds, it's possible it's just a bunch of moms looking to learn how to clean a little bit faster, similar to how I got into this in the first place. So why don't we take a look at the comments and they'll probably give us a better picture of, of who's watching these. I love ginger hotties. I prefer to look at your legs than at the vacuum cleaner. <laughs> you are a perfect woman. My angel, I love you so much, BB. Hard eyes emoji times 10. Let me help you with that, love. She knows where to climb. I could watch you clean in those shorts for hours. Thank you very much. I really enjoyed your video. Keep them coming, and I am definitely a new subscriber. <laughs> She's cleaning! I don't understand. It's like 15 minutes of her just cleaning. The only thing I can think of that I hate worse than cleaning is watching somebody else clean. But, oh, wait. Oh, that's right. Her, her ass is fully out almost. Okay, I get it. Sweetie, you get better with each video. Mm, yeah, you, you really know how to work that wet jet Swiffer. I want you to dust those floors again for me. Yeah, dust that countertop, you sick mother. Oh, man. I could read these comment sections for hours and just never get bored man this is like this is this a plus entertainment report card as far as entertainment goes this comment section a plus plus i'm giving that a check triple plus this is my shit oh man thank you guys for having fun with me man i gotta tell you god bless the internet it is just a laugh a minute up in here youtube what a treat listen i wasn't kidding by the way about that Ugly Christmas sweater, Leon Lush design. Yeah, it's got Nigel on it. It's got the ugly Christmas sweater print. It's in the shop right now in the link in the description uh, on sale through the end of this weekend, 25% off. Um, use code ugly tomato. Go cop yourself one of those. If you got like an ugly Christmas sweater party coming up or you just want to look fly around the dinner table at, uh, you know, Christmas time. Do appreciate you. Listen, I, I'm not going to do the typical outro today because I'm getting a little anxious because I got a lot of cleaning to do. But as always, I appreciate your time. And if you could just do me a favor, hip thrust uh, the fucking like button, obviously. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. But last thing I'm going to tell you, just when you dust, my only, I just little tip for you. When you're dusting, make sure you use like the sides of the Swiffer as well. Just not the, just not face down because like you can get a lot, you can trap a lot there. But so we're just going to get started.